fun, bones, muscle, it's true. And what that means is, I could see you. I'm not Netflix. I am not YouTube. I am not HBO Go. I am not Prime. You cannot deliver me to your house express for $5.99. It's not possible. So I want you guys to bring it back. Bring it back to the year 1995. Before technology ruled our lives. And I want everybody to be present and enjoy a live interactive show. Now, if you see something you like, guys, make some noise. If you see something you don't like, make some noise. If you see something you cannot do, make some noise. What's the moral of the story, guys? To make some noise. That's right. I come from a loud Italian family down in South Brooklyn, like I mentioned before, and I want to make my father proud. So I want each and every one of you to be part of my family for the next ten minutes. So we're going to start by when we're going to get loud. We're going to hoop, holler, scream, throw a baby in there even. And you know why? Well, because I'm it gets me going, it gives me the energy I need to do my show, and it also lets everybody else know around us that something else is going on besides seals going, oh, oh, oh. all right guys, all right. Three, on the count of three, we're going to make so much noise that they're going to hear us at that end of the pier, and that end of the pier, and they're going to come running, all right, all together guys, most your mouths, even if you got a mask on, What I have in my hand here is a solid 15 inch blade. It's going to go down my throat into my esophagus, ever so gently pushing my heart to the left, in between my lungs, and it's going to end its journey in no other place but my, my stomach. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Now, over the quarantine, I spent a lot of time locked up swallowing swords for my plants. It was quite boring. So like I said, when I do my trick, I want to hear you guys because it gives me the adrenaline I need because frankly, I don't do any drugs. So this is what you guys are my drug for the next 10 minutes. So I call this trick the believer. And the reason why I call it the believer, well, during the quarantine I got into fitness because I got bored of sweet swallowing. So who here, by show of hands, could do a push-up? Raise your hand. Why is it like only the children and like one adult? What happened, guys? Well, anyways, I could do 30 push-ups. I didn't have any. I didn't have any of those muscles before the quarantine. I got really into burpees. It's a killer. So my first trick I called Lisa because what I'm going to do, I am going to incorporate my fitness with sword swallowing. Yes, sir, you're not going to believe it, but I am going to take this sword and swallow it down into the pit of my gullet, and then while the sword is in my esophagus, I am going to get down and hit five push-ups. Let that sink in. Sword swallowing and push-ups at the same time. Can I get a, that's awesome! That's awesome! three tricks for you today. The second trick, well it involves gravity. I'm not even going to talk about it. I'm going to let you guys see it. And the third trick, well, you guys will determine that will be. So are you guys ready for the show? Yeah, oh yeah. yeah! Oh yeah! Here we go. I'm going to kick up this music and we are going to have some fun and boogie woogie woogie. It's my last show of the day. I'm tired. I'm going to go home. Frankly, push-ups happen on 
crowd. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, count it down with me. Five, 